This is my review for Cut the Rope 2. Uh, it's 99 cents on the iPhone and the iPad right now, and I'm sure it's gonna be coming to Android devices sometime soon. And I absolutely love this game. Uh, for 99 cents, you can't get more value for a portable game. There are microtransactions, but they're used very sparingly, and they don't force you to buy them the way that so many games do force you to buy microtransactions. So let's take a look at the game. Uh, it comes with five different worlds. Each world has 20 levels and then four unlockable levels. And every level has um, a three-star challenge. In addition to the three-star challenge, it also has like a bonus medal that you can earn, like a, like a special way of completing the level. So let's look at the last level of world one. Um, every world has a variety of game mechanics. This one, I mean, if, if you haven't played Cutthroat before, the, the objective is to get the candy that's kind of floating left and right right now that's attached to the little bug, the helicopter bug. Uh, you're supposed to get the candy down to Omnom, the green monster on the bottom. <laughs> so what you can do is just get the candy straight to him, and this time I only got one star. So that was very easy. Not much of a challenge there. Not very difficult, but the real challenge comes when you're trying to get all three stars. So you have to kind of think outside the box on a lot of these levels and use every mechanic that the level gives you to get all three stars. So I got two of the stars so far, and now I'm going to move that candy up and over. I'm going to drop that log. And now... Oh, and then I missed the drop. Shoot. So... It's an iPhone puzzle game, so obviously the controls aren't super precise, and there will be times where you screw up a perfectly good run, like I just did right there, by um, misclicking or just accidentally mistiming something very minorly. Oh, shoot. I did not mean to drop the log there. Maybe I can get him. Oh, holy crap, I can't believe that worked out. So now I just have to time the drop perfectly on the helicopter bug. Oh, yes. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, and that's the three-star challenge. And like I was saying before, every world has um, a gold medal challenge. So you can see on the bottom, the to complete the mission for this level, you have to collect one star and cut zero ropes. So here's how to do that. So you drop the candy, and I can't cut that rope or else it'd be very easy to do uh, this medal right now. So we have to do, oh shoot. Oh, I screwed up because I clicked two stars. So you drop, drop the candy down there. Then you just get the log to go up and over, and then I went too far. Shoot. So let's try to get the log up there. And then you drop it. Oh, dang it, and then it didn't go over. So it's a lot of experimenting. Like, this is a great game for playing on a bus or, you know, very short play sessions. I mean, th it really doesn't get better for an iPhone game than Cut the Rope 2. Hey, there we go. No ropes cut, one star collected. I got the medal that time. Um, so let's go over the microtransactions because that is an important thing. Like I was saying before, um, the game's only 99 cents, but uh, there are microtransactions. Um, there are cosmetic microtransactions where you can buy uh, different sets of clothes for different guys, like the QD Valentine set for two bucks, superhero set, purely cosmetic things. Um, there are some power ups you can use in the levels, and I will show those off um, after I show the prices. Hey, and look at that. They show the prices on the buy screen, not at the confirm screen, unlike Angry Birds Go. Um, so the candy. The Candy Rain, this is basically, this basically makes it very easy to finish the level. It just rains tons of pieces of candy from the sky, which usually picks up every star and finishes the level instantly. So it's kind of just like a, a cheat card. Just finish the levels instantly. The Balloons, I bought the pack of 150 because um, there are hidden clovers. There's, I think, 23 hidden clovers throughout the game and you have to use balloons to get them. But when you, um, there's a daily reward for playing the game every day, and sometimes you'll get balloons for free from doing the daily rewards. So it's not, um, 
it's not impossible to find all the hidden clovers without spending money but it's just challenging and it will take you some time to kind of build up enough free balloons but 150 balloons for five bucks i was more than happy to pay that just because i'm really enjoying this game so far and the solution firefly he basically shows you exactly like step by step how to complete the levels but because you're subscribed to wiki game guides right <laughs> uh i'm gonna be making walkthroughs for every level so you do not need to actually go ahead and buy these solutions and of course they have like some value packs where you can buy infinite of all the power-ups for 50 bucks which is kind of crazy or 25 of every pack and uh or every power up for five bucks so i'll do that same level and show you oh look at that i got the christmas one enabled so you do get some of the cosmetic skins for free um so the balloons you can attach to any item and kind of move uh, manipulate the the objects in ways that would normally not be available so as you saw there i put three balloons on omnom or three balloons on the log or whatever um that only uses one balloon like using the power the balloon power up only uses one balloon until you fail the level and then that uses that balloon so i'm, I'm not using like 50 balloons at a time there i'm just using one balloon to activate the power up um i guess i have to restart the level to show the candy rain uh so this is what happens when you use the candy rain just drops a whole bunch of them look at that completed level three stars <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's kind of a way of cheating the level, but whatever. It's there if you are getting stuck on a very frustrating level. And uh, yeah, like I was saying, there's a ton, there, there are a ton of challenges. And for 99 cents, you really can't find a better iPhone game. Um, highly recommend it. Click the link in the description to download Cut the Rope 2 or go to wgg.mobi slash ctr2 or and uh and thanks for checking out this video um, if you're not already subscribed to this youtube channel please do so uh for more iphone reviews and more game reviews thanks for watching game on